I want to sketch the graph of this function here. Now before you do anything, you need to look at it and see what values of x are allowed. You can't have x equal to 1 because if x is equal to 1, you would have to divide by 0. Also, as you let x get close to 1, the bottom here gets very small, but the top does not get particularly small. The top would, it appears, get closer and closer to 1, essentially. And so that's the, there's going to be something interesting happening at x equal to 1. Now, what I'll do is I'm going to graph uh, a, uh, a lot of ordered pairs. And then, after graphing the ordered pairs, I will uh, connect them up with a curve. So first, the ordered pair. So here are the uh, ordered pairs that have been graphed. You see what's happening. Uh, you can see how it's going to kind of come down like this. And uh, what it's going to end up doing is it's going to get really, really steep here and never get to 1. And similarly up here it's going to get real steep, although we probably won't see that in the, um, in the graph. So now what I'm going to do is connect these up with a, uh, a curve. And I'm also going to uh, make the picture a little larger so you can see how the final graph looks. So this is the graph that results. You see the points we plotted first and now they've been connected up with lines. And what happened here was more points were picked in order to, to get this behavior. And you can see what it's doing as it approaches 1. It just gets really large, and as it approaches 1 on the left-hand side, it gets very large in the negative direction. So that's its graph.